Hi guys, Technical Gamer here, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you another class for MLG in game battles. Um, I thank, like, thanks for the support on the last one. I think I got 82 views last time I checked. It was really, really good. So just keep it up. Uh, I really, really like enjoyed making the video, and I hope you enjoyed watching it. But today's video is using the MTAR X. Uh, it has four grip and muzzle brake on it again. Um, the only reason I use it is because basically the only one's best for it um the full grip basically just re reduces the little recoil it has on it you can change it out but i don't recommend it um and muzzle break you could use something else like a silencer or something the silencer doesn't decrease the damage it just it just basically makes you stealthy and it doesn't take anything really off the gun it just decreases range um Muzzle break. I use this just to increase the range. Um, it does say increase damage at long range. It doesn't increase the damage. It does. It just increases the longer range um, ability on it. I do have the gold camo because I have unlocked all of the um, camos, like for the standard ones. Um, if you want to join my clan, it is at level 12, um, and we need to get to level 23 to get the kiss of death camo. Um, yeah, the other camos have come out, like the ducky one and um, the circuit one off, that, that I remember off by heart. But, yeah, basically, if you want to go and get them, I think they're, a few of them are £3 because they get um, the characters with them, but some of them are like 69p and all that. The next part of my class, I do not use a secondary. Um, it basically just lets me have a, an extra perk, really. I don't have a lethal either, um, and I have a tactical, though. Uh, the reason why I have this, it leads kind of into the perks. I'm not going to spoil anything, but it's basically just pre-checking corners or um, flashing someone or flashing multiple enemies. If um, basically, yeah, if you need to flash them, um, really. I've my stats are at the moment. Just reading it here. Um, I've used it a thousand four hundred and sixty times, and I've hit five hundred and fifty-five. So most of them are really kind of checking corners. Um, but I just really enjoy using this and it's like an add to the class really. You can put a um, a lethal, I would rather do a frag grenade because they don't stick if you do it wrong. Carrying on, my perks I am using are ready up agility marathon, dead silence, focus and extra tactical. The reason why I use these is because it's a rushing class. And it's really really fun to use it as a Russian class. It's quite an it like it's it's a really good gun. It has reasonably good hip fire. It is an SMG, so it should have. Um it has pretty good range if you have the grip and the fore grip the grip and the muzzle brakes already on it. And yeah, the agility and marathon kind of speeds you up and keep you running for a long time. Um and ready up basically brings up your gun faster. You don't really need to use it, but I just it's a habit really. Dead Science and Focus. Uh, coming to these is really essential you use these for game battles and um, MLG because most of the time you're going to be playing against decent players and they're going to be able to get their shots on target. That's why you need Focus. Less flinch when you're going into a gunfight. Uh, sometimes they don't even shoot at all and you get an easy kill. But Dead Science, you don't want to be heard of like, across the map. Yeah, you can't use Amplify but you can still hear people even if you're using Amplify and they're using Dead Silence so it kind of counteracts that really but yeah just use it because they've banned Amplifier so you can just sneak around the map and all that extra tactical reason I use this because I get two concussions then the reason why I use uh, that is because if I just use one for checking corners and then one if someone's on a bomb flash them kill them easy kill but yeah, these are all basically catered to rushing, and I really enjoy this class setup, and I hope you enjoy using it too. Moving on, my strike package is Specialist. The reason why I use this is because it's really, really easy, and it's the only thing you can use in MLG in game battles. And who doesn't want extra perks if they get 3 kills, 6 kills, or even 8 kills? Um, the first one I use is ICU. Uh, re regenerates health faster. Uh, resupply, basically scavenger, um, I kind of said that wrong, but yeah, anyway, resupply ammo after killing someone, they drop a little blue bag, it kind of looks like a handbag, pick it up, and you get more ammo, so, um, after that, pick a random perk, doesn't really matter, um, and then when you do this, you click on slat of hand, strong arm, yeah, that's a bit of a freaky one, but strong arm, you got a concussion, you got two, so you kind of need to lob them real far, 
um, and Blast Shield uh, as the last one. Um, and then just basically click on your random perk you clicked. Um, the two main random perks I would say to use because I don't really use them as much is Takedown and Recon. Just them two I don't really use at all really. Just use them as pa random perks if I ever ask you to use a random perk. Okay, unfortunately, it is at the end of the video now. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, just please recommend uh, any classes you want me to use or any guns you want me to review and make a class for. Um, please put in the please put in the comments um, what you want me to do next. But as always, this is Technical Gamer. Drop it.